In a few days, families across the country will gather around the table for the biggest meal of the year. However, this particular dinner will cost more than it has in years. Families are struggling, and there have been fewer donations at food banks nationwide. Skylar Henry has the latest. Families across the country are putting the finishing touches on their Thanksgiving menus as food costs skyrocket, gobbling up more money and putting a heavy strain on the holiday budget. This is kind of like our Super Bowl. We build up to this. This is our biggest event. Tracy Collins is on a team that runs Bread for the City, Washington, D.C.'s largest food bank that helps food insecure families year round. This year, in addition to groceries for Turkey Day, Volunteers are also including prepaid debit cards so households can spend the money on whatever they need. Well, it's a little bittersweet that we have to be here to do this work. You know, we're really proud and privileged to be able to support our community members like this, provide this direct services, but we really wish we didn't have to be here. Experts say inflation, global food challenges, and supply chain issues have pushed the cost of a Thanksgiving meal for 10 people up to $64 this year. That's almost $11 more than last year and nearly $20 more than just two years ago. We're still operating at an elevated level. Food banks across the country will tell you that they're seeing more families now than they did even at the peak of the pandemic because of the rising food prices. Seniors are among those at the highest risk of going without a meal on Thanksgiving Day. Transportation challenges and the lag in Social Security benefits mean they could be suffering in silence. You know, a lot of seniors are hungry. They won't tell you but a lot of seniors are hungry. Volunteers at Bread for the City say their clients come from every corner of the nation's capital. Despite the growing need, those donating their time, money, and resources say they're thankful to dish out as much as possible to help ease the burden of feeding families this holiday season. Skyler Henry, CBS News, Washington. Sticking